My name is Joaquin Thomas. I am the president of Gold Solar Construction. I've been in solar for 10 years. I just love it. The guys that I hire are from these areas, born and raised. I'm able to offer guys a career. They can support a family and they have opportunities to grow. So we're at George Ford Square here in Minneapolis. We actually are doing an array literally like two buildings down from here. It's exciting and it's meaningful and I'm honored to be a part of the project. Lake Street Solar and the dollars they invest in keeps it all possible. We were looking for some opportunities to invest. I wanted to create some opportunities for underserved communities, especially after the George Floyd murder and um, some of the impact that Lake Street and Lake Street communities have had. We were introduced to Minnesota Interfaith Power and Light. One of the things that we bring is just a lot of relationships. What we have done is we have modeled how if a group of people come together and look at whatever the circumstances are, that they can put creative solutions together, that we don't have to be defined by what the big banks want us to do. So we're at 2100 Emerson Liberty Community Church. We're actually our own little small utility up here, believe it or not. We're going to invest in the community, we're going to invest in solar, and we're going to invest in companies like JT that have a mission to train and expand the workforce that comes from this community. We oftentimes won't have hope that we can be engaged because we don't see people look like us. So Go Solar looks like us. My name is Alika Galloway. I serve as um, one of the senior pastors at Liberty Community Church and also CEO of Northside Healing Space, a radical, restorative place that we co-create for healing on the north side of Minneapolis. Northside Healing Space started with a dream and a request from survivors of sex trading and trafficking, and they wanted a place to rest they wanted a place to remember their humanity and to resist objectification as they revive. But you cannot heal if your planet is sick. So the same thing we do to women and girls and boys and men who practice survival sex trade, objectifying that body, objectifying that personhood is what we have done to the planet. Having clean, local, Energy just makes sense at the end of the day. I don't even want diversity to be a, a big deal because it's just normal, right? I want my, my kids to grow up and you know not have to experience the pain that comes with racial disparities. This is just the beginning of a partnership and of a relationship, it's not the end. So as I think forward into all the ways that we can build opportunities for sustainable jobs and supporting families, this is just the beginning of that story. 